channel today we're bitch what are we doing we're unboxing and reviewing two perfumes that are a little bit different than your usual so i'm really excited let's get into it like this MU Bath Body Home. Oops. Little thank you card. Comes like this. Oh, I thought they'd only sent one because of how small this box is, but no, they're both in here. Ooh. I'm so excited. Okay, so these are the two scents I got. Chocolate chip cookie. Vanilla cookie dough. And the reason I brought these is because... Me and my partner were at the gym the other day, because where else am I if I'm not working? Jesus. Um, and he mentioned smelling this, like, cookie scent. And I don't know why, I just started thinking, like, because we both drown ourselves in perfume when we go anywhere, but especially at the gym, because obviously you're sweating and, like, you don't want to be one of those people where it's like, bro, you stink. So, yeah. I don't know why I just started thinking about perfume and I started thinking about why I like my favorite scents for anything around the home is like caramel vanilla a little bit of coconut but not like full coconut but yeah more vanilla caramelly type scents so I'll always get those for like around the home things like moisturizers body things I love that but for some reason I have no perfumes that smell like that and I just was like, what? Why? That's like my favorite scent. At the moment, I wear more sweeter perfumes. Like my favorite of all time is Black Opium. And I love it, but it's super, super sweet. And I just feel like, and I love it because like I usually like sweet smelling perfumes because they just make me smell like a lolly. And like who doesn't want to smell like lollies? Another reason why I love like opium is because it's so strong. Like I'll spray, I don't even need to drown myself in it. I'll just spray a few sprays on me and then I'll go out, do whatever for the whole day and I can still smell it on my skin and then I'll wash my clothes and I can still smell it. And I, that is what I need in perfume. Like I need that because I want to be able to smell good all day and not worry about it. Even though I will reapply it just so I know I smell good. I just like to know that even if I don't get the chance to reapply, I'm still going to smell bomb. Because that's important. Like, if you smell good, it just makes you feel good. So yeah, anyway, after the conversation with my partner about like why, pretty much a conversation with myself because I was just thinking out loud, but he was like there. I'm like, why do I not have any perfumes that smell like shit I love? Like caramel and vanilla and stuff. I'm going to Google like perfumes that I can get that smell like that and because he had mentioned the the cookie thing I was like oh like that's kind of on the same scent I don't know what they call it um thing S scent I don't fucking know but it's kind of like the same thing like hey, same kind of notes that's the word. same kind of notes as caramel I think so you know what? I'm just like let's go but when I was looking at reviews on these ones they're called Dim, Dim Meter. They have a bunch of weird ones too. Like they have one that was like tomato juice. And they have one that says dirt. And when I was looking at reviews, someone legit brought dirt. The dirt one. I'm like, why? But do you? Um, yeah, but when I was looking at the reviews, they say they... Well, it was actually kind of mixed. So a lot of people said that they smell really, really good. But most people said that they don't last long on your skin. 
So because of that, I went and bought uh, another perfume that, according to Google and reviews, was very much caramelly slash vanilla. So I, this is her. It's the Prada Candy. And it is ugh, amazing. It smells exactly like something I would have in my diffuser at home or a candle that I would legit buy. So, love her. So yeah, I thought if I paired one of these or both of them with that, that would give it the longevity to just stay on my skin for longer. Because even though I got this the other day, but I've worn it twice already and it lasts on your skin. So I think that will help. Let's fucking try this shit. Okay, first chocolate chip cookie. Oh my god. That legit smells like chocolate chip cookie. Like legit, like you just... Oh my, that's crazy. That is, that's crazy. It legit smells like chocolate chip cookie. Like, I can't even say it just, it just smelt taste. What does it taste like? Um, I can't even say it just smells like chocolate either because you can tell it's like... Like, you can tell it's a cookie. It smells like you've just opened the oven to a fresh batch of cookies. That is... I'm shook. I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Now we got to see... Because you know how when you leave like perfume reacts different to different skin and whatever? Let's see how she wears and then we'll try the vanilla cookie dough. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Uh. Okay, I'm gonna let her settle for a bit because I read on the reviews, a lot of girls were saying that at first when you spray it, it smells really artificial vanilla. But you give it a few minutes and then it settles into your skin and it smells like a really nice buttery like vanilla. But, mm, I can kind of smell it now. But just then when I sprayed it and I smelt it, it smelt like that medicine I'd have as a kid. I swear every kid in New Zealand has had it. I don't even know what it's called. But it's like this red liquid, red orange liquid stuff. And it just, I remember always having it as a kid, like when I was sick and stuff. Ugh. And I can just, when I smelt that, I could just taste it in my mouth. It still smells like it. It's weird though because like from up here if I just sniff like it smells like a nice vanilla but as soon as I go to my arm yeah, it just has that real like medicine-y artificial nasty smell to it. So I don't know if if we leave it on the skin for a bit it'll just settle and it will smell nice because that one yeah, that one smells good. That one smells like chocolate chip cookie. And also, what if we put this on it? Bitch, I just... Oh, this perfume is delicious. Yeah, so if you put those two together, this one does pretty much like it takes over but not like you can still smell the vanilla cookie dough but this one just like makes it more sophisticated I am not one of those people like I've seen girls do perfume reviews and it's like oh it's this these notes and these notes and blah blah blah, blah. I don't know what notes and shit they are I'm just like it smells like this or that like it is what it is so what is the next day and I thought I would just give an update on how the perfume 
wore throughout, throughout the day. So I did spray it on me last night just before I went to bed to see if it, like to see if I woke up and it was still on my skin and it was. And then today after a shower, I put on a bunch of the chocolate chip cookie and vanilla. This is them again. Put on a bunch of this shit, just like, like drowned myself in it. Um, and I have to say, the the like medicine-y smell that it had yesterday is like way way less now so you can't really smell that um when because because when you first sprayed it you could just straight up smell like that medicine and with a little hint of vanilla now when i spray it i can't really smell that medicine taste also it kind of gives like like fake really really fake vanilla smell but then as the comments were saying like i mentioned yesterday as you wear it throughout the day it just kind of like goes into a nice vanilla scent um so yeah it's actually really nice very subtle um also it did last on my skin all day today um and i asked my partner if he could still smell it on me at the end of the day and he said yes so that's good i don't think if you were like walking past someone they could get they'd get a whiff of it like like the black opium perfume that's my favorite because that's what i love about that perfume as well like you can just sm like you walk into a room and you everyone can smell it and that's what i love um so i don't think these will do that but really really nice and the chocolate chip cookie one, um, I feel like is more prominent when you wear the two together. So you can definitely smell the chocolate chip cookie and then it's kind of just like a subtle vanilla in there. But you can definitely still smell it. It's, it's so funny that they actually smell like that. And I'm really surprised at the vanilla because as I said it started off kind of nasty but now it's good. Yeah, see, so that spray had none of that medicine smell that I was talking about. It's just straight vanilla. You can smell a little bit like like the artificial type smell. I don't know how to explain that smell, but um, it kind of has that when you first spray it on your skin. But that goes away and then it's just like a buttery vanilla. Mmm! So fucking good. And then I also put this on my skin... The Nourish Bar Protein Plus Body Butter Cacao, which I don't even know how to say that, Banana, Coconut, and Vanilla. Mmm. So I really smell like, like a caramel treat. Delicious. Um, yes, yeah, so that was all. I just wanted to jump back in and say that. Also, I didn't even say how much they were. I brought these two from MU Australia. They were like $30 each, so for a 30 mil. So not bad. I will probably buy them again, to be honest. I kind of want to try some of the other scents because they've got a bunch of other yummy smelling perfumes that I haven't tried yet. Um, I will not be trying the dirt and like tomato juice one they have because who the fuck is buying that? But yeah, no, those are really, really cute. And as I said before, if you put it with the Prada perfume, mm, just, it just stays on. Like they all just mix together and it's just like, like a caramel cookie vanilla -y treat. It's amazing. So yeah, definitely get yourself some of those if you're into that sort of scent. I'm um, pleasantly surprised by them. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.